Oh my goodness, I was not planning on coming out today, but it snowed last night. A crazy, stick to everything kind of snow. <laughs> it's magic. I can't, I can't believe it. I've told my mother, I've told my friend, but I can bring myself to tell you what I think. This has got to be one of the most beautiful trees I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh, wow. The orange and the snow. And we had so much rain yesterday. And so the snow is just thick and dense and sticking to everything. Oh, okay. I'm going to be going down the escarpment stairs, which is a good 300 stairs. So I'm not going to take out my tripod yet. So I'm handheld. I've got ISO 100, 16 to 35 lens, f2.8 just so that I can get the background trees a little softer. But I'm also going to go to f8 and see which one I like better. And it's giving me a pretty high shutter speed because with the snow it's very bright. It's awesome. <laughs> wow. It is so stunning. I gambled every token. I thought that we could win. But still my heart is playing on a single string. Okay, I'm gonna be using a lot <laughs> of SD card space today. This is incredible, you should see. My harmonies are broken It's like I lost my wings My heart is only playing on a single string I gambled every token I thought that we could win But still my heart is playing On a single string My harmonies are broken It's like I lost my wings before I head down the escarpment stairs, there is a waterfall here and it is flowing. So I'm going to go around to the lookout and see if I can capture that. Wow. Wow. That's amazing. Incredible. I have an image of this waterfall in the fall and it looks absolutely gorgeous with all the colors. And now it looks absolutely gorgeous with the snow. I love this tripod. This is my Manfrotto 190 Go tripod. And if you can see what I've got here, I have the, <laughs> it's a very unconventional configuration. Because of this ra uh, railing, it's difficult for me to get the whole waterfall without the railing in the image. However, the center column of the tripod, I can pull it all the way up and lean it down on a 90 degree angle. So I am shooting almost straight down at this waterfall. It's pretty, pretty cool. You can see there. I am uh, holding on to it though. I've got ISO 50, F22, and that's because I'm not using any filters and I wanna get the water just a little bit smooth. So one third of a second. And of course, as usual, I'm still doing it at F8, 
f11 and at a faster shutter speed just because i just find that it's uh so hard to predict what i'm gonna like best <sighs> i'll tell you what i like best and that's being here I may not make it very far. I'm just so awestruck.
That was the escarpment stairs. I have two choices, either hike back up 300 steps or do a five kilometer hike around. And I think I might do the five kilometers because it was just gorgeous today. <sighs> Hamilton is known as the city of waterfalls and that was just one of the many. So just those two different ones that I saw there, there's gonna be another one on the trail, another, another one on the trail. It's pretty awesome. Look at this canopy. Wow. Incredible, just incredible. <laughs> you should see the trees like come this way. <laughs> There's nothing to fear if you try If you keep believing Like rain falling soft from the sky I'll tend to your knees We Do you remember this bridge? Tom Duncan challenged me to a bridges challenge and this is the bridge that I came to in the fall. Certainly looks different today. Oh, oh so bright and away. My heart So here's the final waterfall that I'm going to visit today. <sighs> worth the hike, worth every second. Truly beautiful. <sighs> Underneath here is just stunning. You don't get too many days like this. If you have the opportunity, you have to go. <laughs> Oh, so bright and red. My 
Yeah, I want to thank you for coming along with me on this impromptu trip, guys. I'm just going to stroll and enjoy the rest. <laughs> oh, I hope that you have a fantastic day and I will see you soon. Okay, bye. We can live here. My heart levitates.